Florida man who was peeing all over room attacks Good Samaritan who tried to stop him. Police. Victim gave drunk suspect a safe place to be. Well, let's see what Captain Fivehead here did. Melbourne, Florida. A drunk Florida man thanked a good Samaritan who gave him a place to stay when he couldn't get home by peeing all over his bedroom and then attacking him, according to a Melbourne police department. The victim said he was at a party in downtown Melbourne on Saturday when he met Colin Gieb, who was described as a friend of a friend. Gieb, 23, was drunk didn't have a way to get home, and couldn't provide his address, so the victim took him back to his place so he could have a safe place to be the record show. The victim allowed Gabe to sleep in room while he slept in another room for the night. Sunday morning, the victim heard noises from around the house and found Gabe peeing everywhere in the room, according to the affidavit. Police said the victim repeatedly asked Gabe to leave, but Gabe wouldn't, and instead became upset and turned violent. He came at me with his penis out and attacked me. Gabe, who's 6 feet and 170 pounds, punched the man multiple times, attempted to choke him, and pushed him into a wall before the victim was able to wrestle Gabe out the front door and call police, the record show. When asked about the incident, Gabe said, You heard the whole story, there's nothing I need to tell you. And asked, Why am I here? According to the authorities. Police say they found blood on the front door, holes in the wall, and a room saturated with urine. Gabe of Melbourne was arrested on battery, indecent exposure, and property damage. Bro, this isn't a drunken disorderly. This is just a Postal 2 LARP. Like, that's all this is. This was just the guy acting out his Postal 2 fantasy. I'm not even mad. Like, that's what I would do in that situation if you don't sign my damn petition. Also, if you haven't played Postal 2, you really should get on it. It's the closest we've come to a Florida Man video game. Look at this. Look at this dude. Look at this good. All right. Not the po okay. Yeah, I'm guessing this Positivity Central guy is like the guy who posts most of the Florida Man story. When wild creatures engage in their natural behavior, such as Florida Man marking his territory and defending it from encroachment, what could be more positive than that? They are. Why would you invite Florida Man to your home? Another Florida man invited him in. They, they would seem to cancel out any shenanigans to follow, but Florida man DNA went out. We're blessed with this story. Two Florida man does not cancel one Florida man. Instead, they increase exponentially. With the numeric base digit being a, on a Florida man and the exponent being... I don't get math. Math is evil. Make it stop. Oh, God. The only reason I passed Calc 2 was blind luck. They did the math. No good deed goes unpunished. That face does look trustworthy. Why am I here? I don't know, man. Maybe you got involved in something bad. Back in high school, a buddy stayed over one night and we got hammered. I woke up to the sound of him pissing in my jumbo western acoustic guitar. I'll never forget that sound. When did you get the gold toilet, he asked. Johnny, I found the guy who shit in your tuba! The fuck you doing in my house, boo? In your house. I can think of a good handful of people who are like this. Oh, America, why are you so annoying each other to each other? Fuck off, Canadian and or European. Once I caught my friend peeing in her filing cabinet drawer, a drunk Florida woman is a sight to behold. 